Welcome to Let's Play Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Justice for All. Um, I'm trying a new recording method, so hopefully it comes out okay. Let's we'll find out. Let's go. Well, shit, I shouldn't do that one. I need to go to new game. There we go, reunion and turnabout, and finally turnabout big top. That's the newest one we got. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the show! Prepare to witness a man who has mastered the wonders of flight! Ooh! The world's greatest magician! The one! The only! Maximilian Galactica! He's flying. Wow, he vanished. That's kind of awesome. December twenty sixth, eight twelve p.m. Very big circus. Circus entrance. Wow, that was like living in a dream. I haven't even caught my breath yet! <laughs> that was amazing, wasn't it, Pearly? It was great! There was a dancing bear! And a tiger that jumped through a ring of fire! An elephant who rode a giant ball! Not to mention that guy who flew through the air! Yeah, Max Galactica! He was absolutely fabulous! Huh? What? Max? Max Galactica, the world's greatest magician! A magic ishin? No, a magician! Um, Mr. Nick? Huh? What is it, Pearls? Does magic have anything to do with channeling spirits? I don't think it has anything to do with channeling. You don't know about magic, do you, Pearls? I'm sorry! Aw, that's cute of her. The doll! I braved the winter's cold and took Pearls to see the circus. It's been six months since the incident in Korain Village. I'm pretty sure that the uh, the first case is actually between Korain Village and this one. I'm not exactly sure though, but I'm sure the date would make sense. It was during that terrible time that I met Pearls. It seems like she is getting starting to get back to normal. Ah, it's time to go. You're right. We can't miss the last train. Pearls, you remember the train? Of course I did! But I don't really understand what everyone means by express train. Well, Nick, see you later. I'll come back, come by the office, and... Uh, I'll come by to help clean the office. It's got to be spotless for the new year. Don't worry about it, really. You're going to visit Mr. Nick on New Year's? Maybe. I'm glad you will get to spend your New Year's with your special someone. P Pearl! Look, it's time to go! Happy New Year, Mr. Nick! Aw, Happy New Year. I really hope it will turn out that way. Aw, that's so nice. December 28th, 9.12 a.m. Wright & Co. Law Offices. Well, today wraps it up for this year. I hope I can finish cleaning this place up in one day. Huh? My phone. Uh, where did I put my fucking phone? Hello? This is Mr. Nick! This is t -t terrible! Ah! Maya! Perfect timing! Things are terrible here too! Huh? The office is a terrible mess, and I have to clean it up! What are you talking about? Um, my dirty office. What are you talking about? Listen, Nick! You have to turn on the TV! The TV? Now let's check in on the scene! Huh? What happened? Thank you, we're at the Very Big f Circus. The Very Big Circus has become the center center of a sensational murder. The scene has created quite a stir among the throngs of excited onlookers. The Very... I mean, the Very Big Circus? That's the circus we went to, right? They're saying that there was a murder? Yeah, they arrested him too! A arrested who? Max! They arrested Max Galactica! Uh, okay. Maximilian Galactica. Fans call it Max. A popular magician who can fly through the sky at will. 
Huh. Maya said he, she was a huge fan of Max. Alright, Nick, I'll see you in two hours at the detention center. Huh? What? See you there! You've still got plenty of time to clean up your office later. What? Ugh. What is her problem? Oh my god. Alright, well, we don't really have much of a choice, but let's go on. December 28th, 1119 AM, Detention Center Visitor Room. What are you- what are they talking about? Why did they arrest Max? You're asking the wrong man on that one, Maya. Maybe he used his magic skill to deal death with the sleight of hand. Maximilian Galacta would never do such a thing! Fabulous! What a young lady just said was absolutely fabulous! What a clever girl, such a fabulous understanding of events! What's with all this fabulous talk? Whoosha! Welcome to the visitor's room! It's Max, Nick! Look! It's real Maximilian Galactica! Alright, sweetie! Pick a card! Any card! He called me sweetie! Oh, Snick! <laughs> Time's running out, sweetie! Pick a card! Any card! Th this one! Oh, <laughs> I thought you would pick that one, sweetie! Ba-boom! The Ace of Hearts! Ah, he got it! He got it, Nick! Look! He got it! What can I say, sweetie? You've stolen one of my most valued possessions! One of Maximilian Galactica's hearts! Max! Oh. Well, time to make this an absolutely fabulous time! Max, you should let Nick pick a card! I don't want to steal one of his hearts. And you are? Oh, silly me! You must be Sweetie's driver! Her driver? Whatever, hurry up and pick a card! Any card! Um, I want this one. So, sweetie, let's be honest here. You came to this visitor's room to visit me, didn't you? Yes! I'm your biggest fan! Fabulous! Absolutely fabulous! Thank you so much! Hey, um, what about my card? Think of it as a souvenir! I don't want it. Well, Nick, I think it's time to get to work! What's the matter, Nick? Why are you looking at the ceiling? I was just thinking about what I should have for lunch. Sweetie, draw Porcupine Head over there. Shower me with your attention, okay? Yee yes Absolutely fabulous! Absolutely cringe-inducing. <clears throat> okay. So now that he's done with that crap, let's finally figure what's going on. Max, I was hoping you could tell me a little more about yourself. Fabulous! I think we should get to know each other better, too. Why don't you come sit next to me? Um, there's a big piece of security glass between us. Oh, sweet Jeebus. What in the world? If only I could use magic, then I could make this wall disappear. What is this guy talking about? Anyway, lately you've become awfully famous, haven't you, Max? That's Maximilian to you, Porcupine Head. Get it straight. Jeez, people nowadays. They get their panties all in a bunch over nothing. Anyway, Maximilian. You won a very prestigious award recently, did you? Not. I did! It was fabulous! I won the Magician's Grand Prix. Grand Prix, held by the Association of International Magicians! It's an award that recognizes that I am the most fabuloso of fabulous ma world magicians. There was a trophy and a bust. It was a fab, I mean, it was an amazing day. Wow, that's incredible! Isn't it? I'm certifiably the greatest magician in the world. I'm gonna guess he didn't win a trophy for most modest magician. Okay. You are signed to an exclusive contract with the Berry Big Circus, correct? That's the long and short of it. You sure do your research, sweetie. I'm impressed. You just can't watch a magician on TV, you know. Magic is so fabulous, you have to see it with your own eyes, sweetie. You're 
right! You're so right! However, the circus, it's a dinosaur, a thing of the past. Nowadays, no one even cares about what goes on there. Huh? What do you mean? That's why I signed the contract. That's why you signed the contract? Thanks to me, the Berry Big Circus is fabulously popular. People come out in droves to catch a glimpse at the magic of Max Galactica. I revived the dinosaur that is the circus. But to me, it was just another magic trick. Isn't that just wonderful, sweetie? Y yes I made all the old crusty circus performers obsolete! But I kind of like the circus performances. Mayo looks a bit down. Right, let's ask him what happened. Tell me what happened at B Very Big Circus. Ah, oh, last night, the ringmaster was murdered. The ringmaster? You mean Russell Berry? Haha, <laughs> Russell Berry. Someone smashed him over the head, I hear. He was slumped over on the ground. Even though it was the middle of the night, the police pres presence was fabulous. The police questioned me at length. Question you about what? About everything. I was the last one to see the ringmaster before he was murdered. I saw him that night in his room. So then why were you arrested? Arrested? Don't make an anthill into a mountain, sweetie. They just wanted to consult with me on matters, that's all. Nick? I don't think Max understands how serious this is. She's right. I think I should shock him back to reality. <clears throat> okay, so he doesn't realize that he's the suspect. Before the murder, you met with the ringmaster? Uh-huh. What did you talk about? Things that aren't for your ears. Maya, would you please ask him? What did you talk about with the ringmaster, Max? It was nothing. Small talk, really. We were just having a chat about my salary. Salary? I'm the one bringing in all the crowds to the circus. I think that I should be compensated as such. You agree, don't you? Y yes That's all you talked about? Of course! It was a fabulous chat! Okay, so he's got locks. Fabulous? Why does he have to keep saying fabulous? What's the matter, Nick? You look all bent out of shape. Okay. So now that we've done all that, it's time to present our most important thing. What is that badge? Is it used in a disappearing act? I'm not a magician, Max. I'm an attorney. An attorney? Then why are you wasting your time talking to me? He isn't wasting his time, Max. You're... Okay, okay, relax, sweetie. You're just a little over-anxious, I think. Anyways, I've been curious about something for a while now. What's that? Why do you keep looking at me with such sad look in your in your face, sweetie? But because you've been arrested for murder. Oh, don't be ignorant. Why would they arrest someone like me? Why is that? Obviously, because I'm the fabulous Maximilian Galactica. So, I'm a very big star at the very big circus, and that means. I'm rich! I'm paid fabulous sums! Which means what? Max? Quit joking around, you've got to be pulling my magic wand! The police aren't really serious about all this, are they? They don't arrest people as a joke. Ugh. Look at Max, he's crushed! Well, he needed to wake up and smell the coffee. This is serious business. Um, uh... Yes? Poor, poor, I mean, sir, you're a lawyer, right? Huh? Oh, yeah. I'm an attorney. Please help me. I didn't kill nobody. Didn't kill nobody? I may be more spoiled than a hog in a hamburger mud pit, but a killer? That's insane. I, I, I could never. My Max? I swear. I just wanted to pay off my daddy's debt. He's back on the farm. Okay, okay, I'll take your case. Really? Really? Uh, thank you much. Y'all such nice folks. Um, Max? Yes? What's your real name? 
Billy Bob Johns. Ugh! What's the matter, Maya? He's really just a country bumpkin. Oh, God, you're so stupid, man. <clears throat> I must apologize for not being my absolutely fabulous self just now, sweetie. Huh? huh? Mr. Attorney, yes? A few minutes ago, you took one of my cards, didn't you? <laughs> 